Hi, my name is Eric Lee. I'm the co-founder and executive chef here at Ugly Burger. I'm originally from Hong Kong, uh, but I grew up in the Netherlands and Germany for a brief time. Um, but most of my life I was in the UK. So Ugly Burger was actually a pandemic baby. We started it in April of 2020 during the lockdowns. Uh, we opened it as a cloud concept initially, but uh, after a while it, it got traction and then we grew the business into a physical space, firstly in Darawasso Mall for one year. And then now we're here in Nakhil Mall in Palm Jumeirah. So when we first started testing for Ugly Burger, I was inside a Korean restaurant of one of the co-founders. Uh, basically, we didn't have any of the equipment to cook the burgers, so we started using the Korean pots and pans. And the first burger we ever made was basically very, very ugly. Uh, one of the co-founders, Chang, he sent the picture over to his wife, who was in Korea at the time. And the first thing that she said was, uh, that's a really ugly burger. So that name kind of stuck with us and we carried forward. I guess what makes Ugly Burger special is firstly the Asian influence that we have for the flavors. Uh, we have items such as the shrimp katsu burger, the Korean fried chicken, the bulldog chicken burger, which was made famous by the spicy noodle challenge. And I guess also we source all of the ingredients very carefully. We use very premium products from our Angus beef, which is grinded in-house every single day to the free range, never frozen chicken thighs for our burgers. I would highly recommend trying our chicken burgers due to the fact that we've switched it up from using breasts. Now we're using thighs, which make the burger much more juicier, much more tastier. Operating a food business in general is always a challenge. Uh, operating multiple food businesses at the same time is probably my biggest challenge at the moment, having to time manage and then also staying ahead of the game and being relevant at all times in the market. It will stay relevant with our Asian influence. I believe that we can push the boundaries in a very flooded burger market right now. Uh, we plan to introduce more Asian flavors, more twists to the normal burgers that are available here in Dubai and I see it growing as a business and expanding to other countries. Dubai is home. We moved here at the end of 2018. Um, it's a great place to live, it's safe, and the food scene right now is buzzing here in Dubai compared to five years ago. And I really wouldn't believe I could live anywhere else right now. I would probably start off with a very short gym session in the morning, followed by some breakfast. Uh, I love motorsports, so anything to do with racing. I'd love to do a day out in the desert on a dune buggy, and then followed by a family day out at the beach, and then probably just a very, very relaxing evening with some friends at night. Uh, lots and lots of great food in between. <laughs>